Criticate! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> hey, I'm it's super our first bit on Criticate. <laughs> 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 We're like 80 episodes in. We did a bit. Oh, man. It wasn't funny. <laughs> I thought it was funny. That's kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> I have fun, but uh, I, I, I'm super excited to see that. Yeah, I, I think I think he'll be amazing. I think the movie's. I don't be good. think it's gonna be good. You don't? Did you hear the? Did you, have you heard all the behind, behind the scenes stuff? No, no, no. Uh, so Phil Lord and Chris Miller got fired from it. Okay. Uh, a long time ago. Sure. And Ron Howard's taking over. Okay. Uh, but the reason they got fired from it is because they were doing a bunch of comedy shit. Like they had stormtrooper dogs, like dogs with stormtrooper <laughs> outfits and shit, and like, like, um, basically everyone else was on board with the with the, the comedy route. Okay. But uh, the guy playing Han Solo, yeah, he w he doesn't know how to do improv, so he get on camera and just be fucking scared out of his fucking wits. Okay. So he he complained. All right. He complained to Disney. They got him fired. <gasps> oh shit. So uh, now Ron Howard's editing uh, or reshooting like half the movie. But wow. so half the movie's gonna have a comedy style. Half the movie's gonna be a real Star Wars. Oh. So it's gonna be a piece of fucking trash. I don't know. Well. Like they could pull it out, and if they did, I'd be surprised. Yeah, yeah. But man, are my hopes low. Yeah. I'm gonna see it. I think it's gonna be that. Well, that sounds like another Suicide Squad situation. Exactly. So yeah, that's the that, issue. that that's doesn't that's doesn't give me hope. Like I think but. I think the director. <laughs> drop could be salvageable for, for specifically Justice League would be fine because they had to switch directors to Joss Whedon because uh, sure. uh, Zack Snyder's daughter or daughter died. Oh, okay. Yeah, so so he had to he had to stop making the film. And, yeah, and yeah. Joss Whedon is finishing. Well, I love Josh Whedon. Yeah, so I'm I'm, I'm excited to see that movie and I and I think if there's any movie that could pull that out, yeah, it could be that. Yeah. Uh, but I don't think Han Solo is gonna <sighs> recover. It's it sounds fucked. That yeah, that does sound fucked. Shit. That's unfortunate. Uh huh. Cause, cause, yeah, I, I did have hopes for that movie, uh, but we'll see. We'll see yeah. You, you never know. Mm. Like, you you hear this shit, and and sometimes it comes off as as really good. Yeah, of course. Yeah. I mean, what if what if Suicide Squad was just edited by a different company? <laughs> you know how much better of a movie it would have been. It probably could have been a lot better. Yeah. It probably could have been a pretty decent. A decent movie. movie. Yeah. yeah. Jeez. It, it goes to show how important editing is. Yeah. Pretty much really everything. Is. I mean, it's really overlooked. But yeah. My but God, it is, is it important? Super important. Um, actually, that reminds me. I was watch I'm rewatching Gravity Falls. Yeah, which I love. Yeah, great show. Yeah. Uh, they I oh I must have I either missed it or I forgot about it. Uh, Dipper does like they do they do magic spells quote okay. unquote, but it's all like joke Latin. Okay. Uh, so like the, he says like habeas corpus, uh, and other shit like Invictus, and then he says like Are um supposed to be here. Yeah, they're just not on yet. Ooh. And then he says um. Inceptus Nolanus Overatus. And I'm oh like, my <laughs> God! <laughs> so funny. Holy I shit. fucking died. <laughs> that. Holy it's shit. Fucking genius. I mean, I Inception's love. pretty good. Like, I don't have no, any issues with it. I have issues with Inception. <laughs> that's a. That's a. Uh, my. The. Well. The Nico's favorite movie? Uh, oh, Bleep Their Names. Yeah, Bleep shit. Their Names. Uh, friend of the show, Adrian Andrew. Yeah. That's her favorite movie. They, really? They, they have a big boner over Christopher Nolan. Really? Yeah, which is weird because, like, they're filming. I mean, I, yeah, I, so, yeah they are. So, I, I like Nolan's stuff, I, but every director has stuff that I think is overrated. Do you have any interest in Dunkirk? That's in theaters right now, as of the recording of this. I don't really. I, I have no interest in war films. I think yeah, they're shit. So yeah. I don't. I'm not gonna see it. But but uh, you know what? If if I ever do see it, maybe I'll like it. I'll, it's it's I'm, just I'm gonna see it for Harry Styles. <laughs> I just think that Inception is is uh, overrated a lot. And I think oh, the writing yeah, well, is yeah. cluttered and terrible. Uh, and I need to see. I haven't seen it since 2009. Sure, sure. I mean, maybe I'll, maybe I'll rewatch it and love it. But um, that does happen. But it's just from my memory of it, they, they confuse being complicated and convoluted with being smart. Oh, 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 oh. What is this, Kingdom Hearts? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> what is a better story, Kingdom Hearts or, uh, or, or Inception? Oh, Kingdom Hearts. Cause what, At cause, least everything makes sense in Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, so look into it. If you if you look into it and only then, <laughs> if you don't, it makes no goddamn sense. Uh, that's one thing I like about Kingdom Hearts is everyone talks about how confusing the plot is. It's really not. It's really very not confusing if you just if you just read everything. every like, every memo and uh, all of the backstory. Yeah, and if you pay attention, pay attention to the game, it's yeah, yeah, pretty yeah. easy. Um, and even then, who cares? You're just fucking yeah. hitting Woody with a <laughs> at stick. The end, so. Yeah, at the end of the day, you're just hitting black things. Well, that sounds wrong. But you, you're just hitting heartless. Where did you come from? 
<laughs> <laughs> you're just hitting the heartless with a giant key. Yeah. With some Disney characters. Like, yeah, that, that's, that's really all it boils down to. You don't <laughs> yeah. need to pay attention to the plot. No. One. No, no, no. That's what I love about Kingdom Hearts. It's an RPG that doesn't rely on the plot to, for it to be fun. Yeah, that's true. That, that's what I... I mean, I think later they, they focus more on it, which I find unfortunate. I agree. But, but you know, at, they, they still make sure that you... for Well, for most games, they still make sure that you have fun playing them. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, oh, I watched yeah. a really good video on Kingdom Hearts 2 recently. Really? That brought up a lot of the things that you mentioned and, yeah, and a lot yeah. of things that I mentioned and sure. rates it objectively. I'll send it to you. Okay. Yeah, that'd be fun to Jacob see. Jacob doesn't like Kingdom Hearts 2. I love that. I game. don't. We'll, we'll get into that in a podcast. Well, yeah, because we will talk about the Kingdom Hearts series eventually. Um, and it's it's I have a lot of opinions. Yeah. <laughs> we both do. I That's mean, I, <laughs> I, think, I think Kingdom Hearts is a rough 60-40 uh, good game. No, not even mm. then. The first one? No, like 60... No, the whole series. Oh, the series. 60-40 on 60, good 40. games is probably what I'd say. That might be a little high for me. It might be a me. little too much, yeah. I, I, I might... I, I'm also a little bit more critical, but I might say 40-60 like, is good. That makes sense. Yeah, I, like, I can see why you would say yeah, that. Yeah, there, there, there's some stuff. As we've mentioned before, they make the strangest decisions in that series. Yeah. Uh, very weird. Like, there's. they also do a lot of, like... This sounds terrible, especially in Mysterious East, but they make a lot of Japanese decisions. You like know, what? like 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 in the recent trailer for Kingdom Hearts 3, you climb into a mech and start shooting toys. Like, that's <laughs> that's that. just about the most Japanese sentence you can say. That's fair. <laughs> I really like it, though. I, I, need to, I need to emphasize how much I like it. I know. And I'm not saying I don't like it either. It's just sometimes it, it's really weird. Like like the whole Pokemon system thing in Dream Drop awful, Distance. Awful, is Yeah, it's awful, weird. Awful, awful. <laughs> but, but that's also like, a, yeah, cute monsters running around with you fighting shit. I cute. get it. <laughs> yeah, a lot of them aren't even that cute. <laughs> really ugly. <laughs> I'm really weird. And it's weird that they're the enemies to... Uh, I'll stop oh, talking about fuck. Kingdom Hearts. We went way over. Shit. Shit. We'll just... On the next episode of Kingdom Hearts, wait, we'll wait, talk wait. about Alice. Wait, Bye. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Hey, we decided to continue and just continue to cut the episode in half. Yeah. Good. So, okay, welcome back to the uh, 40 to the bajillionth episode of our Kingdom Hearts playthrough. Uh, in this episode, Sora is going to run around and... All right, Ratchet. I'm going to use my summon. Simba! Summons have always been weird to me. Like, like... Simba! <laughs> hey, Simba. Simba, where you at? What the fuck? <laughs> Simba! Hey, it's hey. not... I haven't seen you in a while. Me and Nala, we're kind of, <laughs> we're kind of getting Simba. Uh, we, <laughs> hey, uh, just you know what? Just call me back, all right? Simba. Simba. Hey, man, it's been like three weeks, man. I'd really appreciate it if you just, if you just called back, man. All right. Um, I, I'm, you know, I'm just, I'm just worried, man. Okay. This is a funny bit. <laughs> okay, no, 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 fuck that. We're not. Simba? <laughs> just stop. <laughs> hey, he's found. We got him. Hey. I was going to go down the route if you got like kidnapped yeah. and being tortured. <laughs> Jesus, man. It's fucking Simba. <laughs> yeah, it's Simba from the Lion King. That's what makes yeah. it funny. Uh, this game, though. Back back to this game. Back to how shit this is. Uh, I think, uh, what's the name of the, the parrot? in uh... The parrot? Oh, Iago? No, not in... No, not the parrot. The fucking, about... the fucking jungle bird in... Uh, in oh, 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 oh. Uh, 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 fuck, his name starts with an S? Does it? I, I don't know. know. I, fucking... I, I was going to bring it down the route of he kidnaps Sin oh. Simba for being a piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> wow. But you cut off my bed. Yeah. Yeah, it was it, going on a little long. It was long. going a little long. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I hate that. Did you see the, the, she doesn't actually grab the chain. She gr grabs below it and then pulls it oh, down. Oh, yeah. Ew. Yeah. Icky. Yeah. There's there's little things like that that they could have polished that would have made me really God, rate I this game. Would polish me. <laughs> so creepy. Uh, does that, that, you know, that might get into your thing. In context. Oh, wait. You so didn't mention that. I, I think, I don't know if that was on the episode that we lost. But I oh. think, uh, in case it wasn't, we'll go through really quickly. Okay, yeah. I asked Jacob if he would shag Alice. For and, for story reasons, no. But but we'll find out. We'll find that out during the end of like by the end of the series. Yeah. Um, so ooh, ooh. It, it it turns everything like all the stuff, and I think they play up Alice's sexiness a lot, uh, and, no and and it's creepier in context. 
great. I'm excited. Yeah, it's, uh, it's gonna be fun. Yeah, <laughs> it's like how really. they play up uh, Elizabeth's sexiness in a uh, in a. Uh, um, Bioshock Infinite. Oh yeah, and then there's a really fucked up like, twist. But we're, we're, I'm not gonna spoil. Bioshock yeah, no, Infinite no, no. On the show, but <laughs> but God, why why do games do that? Like, you uh, could just not play up the sexiness if you really wanted to. Like, if you re- if you wanted to have like a twist ending like that. Yeah. For like where there's there's implications and shit. Yeah. Just don't play up the sexiness of your female characters. It's yeah. really fucking simple. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't know. Oh, I think the, the the teapot makes really short work of the crabs. Yeah. That's oh, wow. so good. The teapot makes short work of everything. <laughs> yeah, I've upgraded a lot. I haven't really used it. Yeah, it's... it's By the end, it's all I used. Really? It's just, it's just so much more efficient because you run out of ammo, switch to the pepper grinder, switch back to the teapot. You, you just run around, dodge, don't get hit, and shoot shit. Oh, my God. I need to get out of this crowd. <laughs> Oh, I was just surviving. It was just a survival one. Cool, 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 yeah. cool, cool, cool. All right, once I get the the red, red rose, I'll, uh... I missed the trade! <laughs> 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 he starts choking on his pork or whatever. <laughs> well, funny joke, Robert. Next. <laughs> no, no, you know what confused me? What? I saw a video on YouTube called All Alice Bosses. This game doesn't have bosses. Sure doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> no, so, like... They showed a picture of, like, Rabbit and, um, what's his name? The fucking Dormouse, uh, in, in the giant mech. And I'm like, that's not a boss. It's a joke cutscene. And then it's over. Did they just show the cutscene? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's not a boss. It's not a boss. I'm very confused. Well, I, I, if you want I some more confusion, I think you're going to have to come back on the next Come back and of- watch more Woo! Alice. <laughs> uh, <woo>! Oh, fuck. <laughs> See you, See you guys, guys next time. <laughs> hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Tell us what you're thinking about Alice in the comments below. Okay, bye.